a Carroll County woman facing charges after repeatedly burglarizing a home, making off with property and valuables worth tens of thousands of dollars. WMAR 2 News' Jeff Hager has details of the heist. Tucked between New Windsor and Union Bridge along South Clear Ridge Road, the house appeared to be empty. Who knows who, you know, who's going to move out? Who? They don't, tell, they, don't, they don't put signs. But where neighbors saw signs of abandonment, it appears 39-year-old Amanda Rasmussen spotted an opportunity. According to charging documents, Rasmussen admitted over a two-month period she entered the house on several occasions stealing jewelry, antiques, and collectibles. Over time, she even returned for furniture and a washer and dryer, and no one seemed to notice it. I really wouldn't notice it. I mean, I don't really pay attention. The only thing I pay attention is, like, next door. When the rightful owner of the house returned from a six-month stay in Florida, she found the garage door damaged, a screen cut in the front of the house, and an estimated $30,000 worth of property missing from inside it. She hadn't just been burglarized, her home had literally been cleared out. In a burn pile behind the house, a piece of mail turned up with another New Windsor address on it, and police obtained a warrant and discovered some of the stolen goods there, leading them to Rasmussen, who police say confessed to the thefts. A pat-down of the suspect also produced a baggie containing several small containers filled with meth amphetamines. Rasmussen now faces a series of charges including burglary, theft scheme, and malicious destruction of property that could carry a sentence in excess of 40 years if she's convicted on all counts. In Carroll County, Jeff Hager, WMAR 2 News.